Hello everyone, today we will talk about deep linking in Jetpack Compose. So currently I don't have an ID pass because I I haven't opened the deep links. So let's close this and click here and let's add the link. And this is the link. So idcoding.com slash 34 and this will open the app and we'll have the ID 34. So let's jump into coding. The first thing we need to do is to go to build at creator from the app module and add the navigation compose dependency and now let's go back to the main activity and create the nav controller equals remember nav controller and now we need to create the nav host and pass the nav controller and the start destination oops, is home let's put arguments on separate lines and create the composable and this uh, will be the home and now we need to define the navigation of uh, the deep links and this is a list of nav deep link and this has an URI pattern and this will open the app at this specific URI pattern so let's create the URI so the base URL basically is the HTTPS www.adcoding.com and the pattern will be URI and here we will have an ID so when we'll have an address with a slash and a 4 for example it will open the app at the home screen and now we want to get the backstack entry to get the argument from the deep link so ID equals backstack entry arguments a get string this can be a nullable one so we'll use the qu uh, question mark and now we can create the screen so this will be a box film exercise and the uh, content alignment will be alignment dot center oops center text and this will be the ID and otherwise is no ID fast. Now we need to link the URI to the app so go to tools app links assistant open the URL mapping editor and here we will have the adcoding.com in my example and uh, also we need to be careful because I uh, my URI is HTTPS not HTTP and I need to add an S as you can see this added an intent filter and some things inside so let's take them one by one and see what they are doing the action view means that it can be opened the app can be opened the category default means that the app can be opened by default by the link the category browsable means that it can be opened by a browser the scheme is the protocol that we used so is https in my case and the host is the link the rest of the link now we can check if the url is mapped to the activity so paste the url here and add the as a test url and go to test device on or emulator test app links and let's add a slash here and let's say 34 and run the test as you can see everything works perfectly so if you like this video make sure to subscribe to my channel and also follow my blog to learn more about android see you next time